Good day everyone. My name is Christine Eskupong and I am gonna talk all about the strength, weakness, and the root of behavior of a person. So, tara! <laughs> Discipline. People with strength of discipline are the best known by how they order and plan or bring plan and order to people and places. Laziness. This is another reason for lack of self-discipline. It prevents initiative and perseverance and leads to lack of inner strength. This ability that we should not tolerate to the kids or the young people. Punishment. Relies on treats and fear to get kids to comply and learn their lessons. Anas, allow all people to take responsibility for their feelings and behavior. Build your strength of honesty that will allow you to be good service to God and to others. Hypocrisy, when a person shows their own color, attitude, and feelings to other people but in fact, it's just play acting. Example of this, a person really care about you but in real, he or she doesn't care. Low self-esteem, it is typically a sincere belief that we should not held to the same standards as others because we have better intentions. Attentive, someone who is full of attention, watching and listening carefully. As a student, as attentive, who takes great notes then asks a question when something is not clear. Inattentive, when someone not paying attention to something. As a student, who is lack of attention is easy to distract with small events. Mindful. We should be mindful of where we are or what should be totally focused on the task. Patient. Willingness to suppress restlessness when confronting with delay. When someone being so rushed to have birth for a member, being patient is a virtue. We should learn to wait because we are not the same as what we expect. Perfectionism. A good kind and bad kind, those who try their best and expect themselves and others to do well but who treat failures as being opportunities rather than being indicators. Self-control. It gives them inner peace and the ability to keep smiling despite of challenges. Hardworking. An individual desire to reach that stage in life where he or she will not be material problem. We have different way of getting our desires, needs, and wants. Work too hard. You are working too hard but much better than you would have to if you did not take on more work than could reasonably handle. Don't work too hard because it can lead stress. Diligence. Diligence have moral benefit and an inherent ability value to strengthen character and individual abilities. Trustworthy people are a good influence in the life of others. People bring in the best in others and cherish their lives. We are designed to be in relationship with others and being able to trust each other means that we can do more together. Untrustworthy, one of the greatest weakness that being an untrustworthy person. Identify oneself as being worthy of the respect each other. Responsible, it is a positive behavior that needed to support meaningful lifelong behavior change. Trustworthy people are responsible enough to their action. Accuracy. Freedom from mistake. When someone states their opinion and you as an audience, you have right to say wrong or correct. Eyewitness. Our memories are not as reliable as we think. Sometimes we can even build false recollections about people we only think what we saw. Determine. People make decisions and be a resolve and not to change it. When you have problem, try to resolve your problem then change into something. Respectful, the ability to see and celebrate the value in ourselves and others. When we see others' imperfections, we need to respect because it can lead into an respectful person. Self-centered, they view themselves as better than others. People taking the food in the house when you know others are starving. So be aware of what you're doing and think about it. Polite, showing kind to other people is respect. People who think more advanced, they are not giving attention to distract question. 